We are going away on holiday tomorrow and we have no idea where we're going. <laughs> on the streets of <laughs> My name is Liam Bedford. Are you famous? I don't see her and no one else. <laughs> dead. This is the story of how myself and two of my mates booked the cheapest flights to end up anywhere in the world and for literally just 24 hours. So this is how it all came about. I've been wanting to leave the country recently. I had no desire for anywhere specific, but 100% had the desire to be spontaneous. So the plan I conducted was to book the cheapest flights to anywhere in the world on Monday evening, fly to said place on Tuesday morning, stay for an evening while having a night out, cause why not, then fly back on Wednesday to get back for a comedy night I had tickets for. Simple. This idea was heavily inspired by my favourite YouTubers, The Boys, The Zach and Jay Show. I'll put their videos in the bio below. So, on Friday 25th of October, I met and told my mate Tim, aka Ed Sheeran, to honey now. about this plan of mine. He was sold just like that. One person in. Sick. On the weekend just after, my mate Ollie came down to London to visit. He was sold on the idea, drove back to Bristol just like that, grabbed his passport and drove back. He was in. So, on to Skyscanner, look what the cheapest flights were, get times that worked for us to get back on Wednesday, then book it. Hi. 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 We are going away on holiday tomorrow, and we have no idea where we're going. <laughs> this is probably the most impulsive thing I've ever done. We're literally going to check for cheap flights, whatever the cheapest flights are is where we're going, and we're literally going to be there for 24 hours, there or thereabouts, because we've got to be back on Wednesday evening. So, we're just going to and see where we end up. That's the premise. That's all it is, isn't it? We're going on holiday, basically. It's time for the big old refresh. <laughs> <laughs> We're not going anywhere. We're going yes. out in London. Thanks for watching. If you Thank enjoyed you. this video, please Thank hit you. the like button and subscribe. Thank you very much. Back to a better place. Re-eat load. <laughs> Norway. 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 Oslo. Oslo. Here we go. It looks like we're going to Oslo. Poner Pali in Bedford. In Norway for the first time. Oh, it's alright. I mean, it's cold. So, it's been <laughs> about 16 hours since we made our decision of where we're going to go. We're in Oslo right now. Woo! We've done the most touristy thing we could have done in Oslo. We're at the top of the Oslo Opera House, which is the main touristy thing to do. It's literally five minutes out as we came to the station. We came here straight at the top, get some photos while it's still sunny, back to the apartment. Sun's going down soon, so I don't know. What do you do in Oslo? I think we're gonna have to ask a tourist what they think we should do because we know we, we want to go on a night out, but we've got some intel that it's £10 for a pint, which is unreal. I just missed it. Uh, also, that you, Liam, are uh, responsible for the apartment when you Fantastic. stay there. Fantastic. Yeah. Oh, so responsible. <laughs> <laughs> well, it looks bigger in the pictures. That's nice. Oh, it's low. Oh, it's low. Oh, it's low. Look how buzzing these guys are. <laughs> it's alright, isn't it? It's not bad. It's definitely a tiger. Welcome to Oslo. Aww. You know, I'm gonna send you a bill for that. Yeah, oh yeah. For right. the laugh. <laughs> you send me the invoice, mate. How much is the laugh? Every, every laugh that you have, they're gonna cost you five pounds. I don't know how much I paid. <laughs> Spot the tourists. What right about the statue, mate? Right, we are on the streets of Oslo in Norway right now. We have no idea what to do while we're here. So let's just ask. Oh, it's different in, in, over here, isn't it? I just realized I can't just shout. Do you want to be in a YouTube video? Do you want to be in a video? Wait, how well, many subscribers do you have? Uh, a million. It's really, you want sense about bringing it back? 
tell us what is the best thing to do in Norway, in Oslo specifically, because we have no idea. I mean, drinking. <laughs> drinking is £10 a pint, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, it's pretty expensive here. Yeah. Uh, what to do in Oslo? Do you live here? Uh, no. Yes. I mean... So apparently the best thing to do so far is go to a nightclub in Oslo, which is what we wanted to do. We wanted the night out in Norway, so that's perfect. You should go to Jungstorga, which is a place down there with a lot of cafes and uh, hangouts okay. uh, and uh, shops. It's good for young lads like us. Yes. Okay. For you. Yeah. The, the good looking lads in Oslo? Maybe not the, not the Maybe not the I love Oslo. <laughs> Do you like his costume? It's, it, yeah, it's good. Do you think he looks like a tourist? No, I really thought he was Norwegian. <laughs> <laughs> this is for my YouTube channel. And who are you? My name is Liam Bedford. Oh, yeah. And are your name are is? Are you famous? Yeah. No. <laughs> you could tell by the yeah, couldn't you? Expensive night out for us, guys. But we now know the club. It is Matchbox. Matchbox? Oh no. <laughs> you dropped your coin. Cheers, buddy. What were you doing? <laughs> Hi, what's your name? My name's Rio. My name's Liam, lovely to meet you. How long have you been here? Um, my watch doesn't work. Could you just, just hold that like that? That's perfect. Okay. And this magic trick is all about misdirection, you see. Uh, you said your name was Liam. Yeah. Liam, magicians do this thing called misdirection. They pretend to put something in one hand, but really they're holding it in the other hand. Yeah. If you want to catch me, you need to pay attention exactly in this moment, right there. I'm All scared right. now. No, no, don't worry about it. You can do this, man. I'm shaking. On. One, two, three, go. Which hand is it in? Uh, that one. That one. Bravo. Okay. This time I'm going to go faster, so I need you to pay a little bit more attention. Okay. And if you guys see anything, don't say anything. Cool? All right, let's see. One, two, three, go. Which hand is it in? That one. <laughs> <laughs> it happens, don't worry. That one. Okay, now, now I'm shaking. It's Is this how obvious. I get robbed in Oslo? <laughs> oh, one, two, three, go. Which hand is it in? I think you've got me this time. No, where is it? <laughs> I've That's proper teared this up now. There you go. That's awesome. And what you can do now is just give it a good. In London, what's the cool phrase to say at the moment? Subscribe to Liam Bedford. Hold on real tight and say, subscribe to Liam Bedford. Subscribe. To Liam Bedford! Go ahead, check your hand out. <laughs> Subscribe, <laughs> There we go. I wasn't expecting any of this. It's a good thing you put that coin in my ear, wasn't it? Mate, fantastic. After a few hours of walking about interviewing the locals, it was time to have a few drinks in the apartment, as we couldn't afford £10 drinks all night. Hour and a bit or so of drinking, off to the local delicacy, Pepe's Pizza. Well, we had a f***ing pizza. I had a beer. You're not going to use that for No, I am. I had a beer and no one else did. Because they're all So, I'm about 17 beers down now. We went into the first bar we saw that had people in it, and we very quickly realised we had walked into a salsa bar. Everybody there was fully getting into their dancing. After trying to join in, I very quickly got ushered off the stage because I was getting in the way. So we went on a night out in Oslo and it was the most expensive thing I've ever been on my life. Top dollar. Top dollar. I bought four drinks out and that cost me 40 pounds. 40? I had three God. beers and a vodka coke and that cost me 40 quid. Good thing we pre-drank. We've come to Oslo and what a treat it's been. We'll see you in the morning when we wake up, head back to England and get straight back for that comedy night, right? Yep. Good night. Subscribe to better. And all that counts is here and now. My universe will never be the same. I'm glad you came. I'm glad you came. <laughs> Enough for me to stay. Make it glad you came. The sun goes out. The stars come out. God, he's got it.